What's up guys, Didi Cthulhu here. As you may have noticed on my channel, I have recently hit 999 videos. What does that mean? This one's the 1,000th. Booyah. I want to do something different, something informative. So, I ran into an issue when I first started streaming. I was clipping videos and whatnot, thinking my voice was going to be in them. And when I replayed the videos, my voice was not in them. It took me a pretty long time and I was getting really irritated because I was trying to get my friends audio and stuff in there. Nothing seemed to be working. Well, I found out what the issue is. It's something to do with the party settings. And this is something that a lot of you struggle with, especially people I play with. So I wanted to do a little bit of a tutorial. Now, quick disclaimer, this does not include if you have like an Elgato um, device that that this is completely different from that this is if you do what I do and you record everything strictly from the console so all right I log in you're gonna go to party I'm gonna zoom in a little bit Okay. Okay. Go into party. Create a party. I'm going to make this private so nobody joins, thinking I'm on. Creating party. Not going to invite anybody. All right. In this menu, make sure you go to party settings. From party settings, you have party privacy, adjust mic level, adjust audio mix, chat audio, allow your voice to be shared, and frame rate for share play. Okay, kick me out of the party. Awesome. Okay, let's try that again. I don't know what's going on with my internet connection. Okay. Go. So you go into party settings. See that? Allow your voice to be shared. The problem is, it starts off at do not allow. It's a consent thing. Uh, I'm going to go with that's what Sony had in mind. So, this applies strictly to a party. Make sure that your friends, if you want their audio in it, if you want your audio in it, put it on always allow. You can put it for allow for current party, but then it goes back to do not allow. So always allow, it stays on always allow. So, within the party, let's say you're broadcasting gameplay or you're recording a clip, like I do. At this point, anybody that is in this party needs to have that setting to always allow. So it will record their voice and whatnot. This does not work if you go into game chat yours will record the person recording but not everybody else's it's very important when you're making content that you make sure that everybody's on the same page because you'll have what happens to me sometimes it will seem like I'm talking to myself but in reality I'm in a party and I'm actually communicating with my teammates quite a bit so those of you that play with me um, that see this video, please, you know, put on always allow. Don't change it unless something like really important happens. But even then, you can just turn off your mic and nothing will be recorded. So there's really not too much of a reason to not keep it on always allow. All right, guys, I hope that's informative. Um, I hope I come across quite a few people that could not understand, just like I at one point, why it wasn't recording your voice. Well. That's why it's it's like I said, it's sort of kind of like probably a, a consent um, sort of kind of deal. That's all I could really get from it. But as long as you have that and you're within this party and not game chat, everybody's voices will be recorded. It will be in uh, if you get a video clip, if you're broadcasting gameplay, streaming, whatever. It does not matter. All right, guys, I hope this was informative, and I hope it helps you because I take pride in helping others where I was once at. 
So yeah, let me know uh, in the comment section if this helped you. If you have any questions, I'll be more than happy to answer. But as always guys, leave a like on this video, thumbs up, and subscribe if you haven't already. Alright, till next time guys, peace.